For today's little adventure, we're going to try these two limited edition Johnny Pops. One is pumpkin pie with fresh cream and the other one is frozen peppermint hot chocolate with fresh cream. Right, if you look at the back of the boxes, you can tell the different flavors they've had. Chocolate dipped strawberries, chocolate fudge, strawberries and bananas, pineapple and coconut, chocolate latte, mangoes, root beer float, raspberries and blueberries, chocolate dipped cherries, summer strawberries, mint chocolate dip. Now I've had chocolate dipped strawberries, I've had chocolate fudge, I've had raspberries and blueberries, and I've had summer strawberries. The ones I wouldn't mind trying are chocolate dipped cherries. Um, mangoes and root beer float. I am not a fan of bananas or coconut, so those are not the things I would try. So, if you've never had Johnny Pops, um, I would recommend at least the raspberries and blueberries, summer strawberries, chocolate dipped strawberries, and the chocolate fudge. I really enjoyed them. So, I do like this product in general. So, I'm curious to see if the pumpkin pie is going to be more pumpkin pie ish or cream flavored. And then, same thing with the frozen peppermint hot chocolate. Is it going to be more? Pepper and hot chocolate or more cream. So that's something I'm looking forward to finding out. Calorie rise, this is 110 calories, six grams of fat, um, less than one gram of dietary fiber, and total sugars, 13. Okay, so this is the Johnny Pop on the size of it. Okay, here is the Johnny Pop compared to the size on the box. Well, it looks about pretty accurate there. So there are four of these in a box. All right, so it's kind of a dark, mm, creamy orange color or pumpkin color, more of a pumpkin color, I guess. All right, I'm gonna take a bite and I'm gonna see what it tastes like. All right. Taste the pumpkin. Taste the cream. It feels like you got a good taste of pumpkin, good taste of cream. Kind of feels like frozen pumpkin pie with Cool Whip mixed in it. So they took the pumpkin um, pie part without the crust and added whipped cream and mixed it together. And that's what it tastes like to me. I like it. I think I might buy this box again before um, the haul, before it leaves. If I didn't tell you, I got this at Aldi's. So, but yes. So this is something I would try if you like pumpkin pie and if you like Cool Whip. This is a great combination and I think you would enjoy it. So this is the frozen peppermint hot chocolate with cream, Johnny Pop. And this one has 140 calories, 11 grams of fat, less than one gram of total dietary fiber, and 10 grams of sugar. Right, here's the actual Johnny Pop. Got a little bit of freezer burn on it, but no big deal. I'm gonna try this one. Peppermint. Ooh. A lot of peppermint taste. You get a little bit of hint of the chocolate and the cream at the end, but if you love peppermint, this is the Johnny Pop for you, because it's very pepperminty with a hint of chocolate and cream. <laughs> so saying frozen peppermint hot chocolate? Oh yeah, totally, I agree with that. Mm -hmm. I thought maybe taking another bite. Definitely heavy on the peppermint. Okay. Well, thank you for joining us for today's little adventure of trying Johnny Pop's limited edition frozen peppermint hot chocolate with fresh cream and pumpkin with fresh cream. Hopefully, if you get a chance, you'll try one of these if you like peppermint hot chocolate or if you like pumpkin pie. Please hit the like button. Um, please subscribe. Please leave a comment. And tell me what you would prefer or if you prefer one of the other flavors on the back. Let me know. Have a great day and hope you enjoyed today's little adventure and please join us for tomorrow's.